so hello again and today we're gonna discuss how I made this for the mechanic mechanical mod well I don't really have um, an extra tin can to use but maybe I can just illustrate so as you can see there's a connector here right here they use nut and a bolt and a small spring act as a button if you can see that just put some insulation tape there and foam and I use a uh, a the brass of uh, the 22 caliber long rifle to make it smoother because if you just uh, if you don't have something smooth that wraps around the uh, screw it would be uh, your creak and it, it's not just as smooth yeah you just get the point anyway so as you can see I have a filler right here this thing is used to um, align the battery so here this place there align here yeah, okay. and there and it goes doesn't move much. Yeah. And that's just the purpose of that thing. And, and you can see here I just placed a wire, a copper wire actually. The problem with this kind of mod is that the uh, internal resistance of the body is too high and uh, it. Uh, it uh, drains power from the battery and it doesn't give as much power when you use some lower resistance uh, material like copper right here I'm just I plan to use a solid wire to upgrade this make it better but for now it works so I'm gonna use that and for this one the connector you need to get this one uh, I I'm just gonna show you the um, the uh, pin I used. Anyway, the the one the um, the center post inside, the positive post inside this is uh, not the original one that came with the uh, connector. I replaced it with a small screw and wrapped with shrink wrap. So I'm gonna show you the uh, diagram how, how it's made. <coughs> First, you got this body. You got the body, uh, this, this body of the uh, double mint. This um, bear with my drawing. Great artist. So yes, yes, body. Then there's a connector right uh, uh, here. Yeah, that's the connector right there. And then there's the uh, center post. <coughs> center post right here. Goes straight inside there. And then there's a filler. Um, this is this filler here. Just to make the battery aligned. And I placed the copper wire that goes through here, here, and this directly down to the button. The button. Hmm. So the button's here, and. Uh, So here's the nut. Uh, here's the nut here. Then there's the bolt. And then there's the uh, 
whatever material you want to use to make it a bit softer to hands so just this piece of foam like the one I use here uniform or whatever and uh, whatever shaft you need and all of course the spring we need some sort of spring so we get to make it button like that so it's Rudimentary spin. There we go. That should be a spin. So, so it's actually just this simple to um, make a fully mechanical mod. Just need um, basic knowledge of electronics. To make. So here it goes. Here's the positive. Positive end here. Here's a negative. So the uh, negative. Here you can see the battery is right here. Yeah, that's it. And that's it's basically just it. But of course, just to attach these things inside here, you will need to um, drill a hole. For this. <laughs> The first thing I did here, well, I didn't really have a drill at hand, and didn't really think that I would need a drill at the time. That's what I just did is um, just to use a steel spike and just just kind of pierce it, just pierce it until the hole comes out. And if it's too small, I just jam it even deeper until it gets through and of course and um, for the um the connector the five tank deep tank connector you need something to uh, keep it in place it's hard really hard to find a um, a nut for the other side that's right i don't think you can find it any in any hardware store or any automobile shops so what i did i just did it's just i did um just this epoxy to um, hold it inside. One problem about this thing is that you can also short because if you don't have this, it is um, this has a possibility to just move up and this be exposed, and you might have a short circuit right here, and you just heat up suddenly. Just be aware about that. Always have really a uh, screw there in place, or you can just place it upside down. I place my screw this way, with the head up into like that. But you can also do this instead to prevent the short, so that it won't don't get into contact with the. Uh, body uh, anyway that's it thanks for watching and um, just comment down below for what else whatever question you may have thank you